Most people have at least one significant weakness in their intelligence personality makeup and you've got to be careful not to place yourself in a position where that's going to be a fatal flaw but what you really want to do as far as i can tell if you want to maximize your chances for both success and and let's say well-being is you want to find a strata of occupation in which you would have an intelligence that would put you in the upper quartile that's perfect then you're a big fish in a small pond and you don't want to be this you don't want to be the stupidest guy in the room it's a bloody rough place to be so and you probably don't want to be the smartest guy in the room either because what that probably means is you should be in a different room right you should look at a place where if you're right at the top it's you've mastered it it's time to go somewhere where you're a little lower so that you've got something to climb up for so and I can if you're not hyper conscientious for example you're probably not going to want a job that you have to work 70 hours a week at